Hi, in this short video I will show you how you can change your database currency from euros to dollars or any other currency. First you have to close QuickQuote, then you open your file explorer, go to C, program files x86, search for QuickQuote folder and then in the installation folder you open program and look for convert db.exe then you can run this application that will show you your current location of your database and uh, its name custom.db it's the standard name for the quick quote database and its current um, currency then in the destination database you select in the same folder location in data folder uh, you change the name for the name that you want to identify your database. For example, in this case, well, I will use NZD to convert from euros to New Zealand dollars. Then you can look in this list for New Zealand dollars. Select it. Quick quote will try to retrieve the exchange rate from the internet, but mm, sometimes it might not be able to do it. So you have to uh, define it manually. Click OK. And in this text box, you can define the current or the, um, the exchange rate that you want to, to use to convert your database. This is just in case that you want to use the current values that are in heroes to be converted to dollars. If that is not a, a problem and you uh, will change your database later, the, you can keep it um, the conversion r uh, rate uh, from one to one and then change the, the values that you want. So. When this is uh, all complete, you can select Convert, which will uh, automatically create your new um, database. Now you go back and now uh, to the Quick Quote uh, folder root, enter Data folder, and now you have the custom.db, which is the, the standard name for the Quick Quote database. And now, if we scroll down a little bit, you can find your new database. This is in case you have a lot of uh, databases uh, already created or converted or uh, also um, quick um, database uh, backups from the, the updates that QuickQuote uh, does. What you have to do, you change the name of the custom database. I will use old you have to have quick quote closed otherwise you will not be able to change the name because quick quote is going to be using the, the database and then select the database that you want change the name to simply custom.db click enter and now this is the, dat the database that you are using i will open quick quote and now as you can see, QuickQuote is already using dollars as a currency from the, the database. I will also open the previous project. It uh, will, uh, will be um, alerted that um, the current project was created in a different currency than the one that we are uh, using right now. So you can simply click OK if you want uh, to update the, the, the costs to uh, the new quick quote uh, database in the case that you already have changed the um, the costs in the database you can simply go to recompute and it will be updated to the new um, costs that's it this is all for the database conversion see you next time